All right then, welcome back to Apotheon. It's time to go through the Olympian Gates. Click. Um, in our last video, we went through the uh, the many rivers of Hades and you know handled that whole, well, that hellhole, if you will. Um, pretty pretty seamlessly, really. Uh, despite the whole presence of zombies and skeletons and puzzles, there are actually puzzles, which is nice. Uh, we're not changing our difficulty. We we're apparently going back to our home. I see. On your knees, trespasser. I have watched five ages of men rise and fall, each generation more flawed than the last. I loved you long ago, but how low you have sunk. You disrespect the laws of Olympus. You forget your place in the universe. For your mortal failings, I turn my back on you. I had hoped you would pass with quiet dignity, like those before you. But instead, you spit at my feet. You have the audacity to invade my kingdom, attack my children in their sacred homes, and steal the might of the gods for yourself. These powers you have usurped are the privilege of the divine. And you are not a god. Well, I mean, I'm not surprised that he's pissed. Um, but Hera kind of set us up for this, so... I'm kind of saying... I mean, I'm not saying, but I'm saying. Well, we're back in the village anyway. That was kind of our objective. So, I guess that's okay. This is back literally where we started. Like, the same nook and everything. Um, although this time, we have equipment. Of Asclepius. I never thought I'd see your face again. I think the gods were ignoring us before. They're certainly paying attention now. Not many of us made it up here once the earthquake started, but I've been doing my best to tend to the wounded. Hmm. Well, that explains why things are, in general, rubble and disrepair. Why are they doing this? I mean, I feel bad stealing your stuff, but come on. I got heroing to do. We gotta kick some god butt. Uh, that door is sealed. Looks like we can go like down here. This is this is literally where we started. Uh, good job, good job. There's nowhere to go in this direction. And unless you can really parkour that stuff, uh, I don't think parkour was a thing in ancient Greece though. So I suspect we're stuck with this direction. I'm guessing we will need this oil vase. I mean, that worked. I'm pretty sure that did damage. Let's get, pin him in a corner. Take that mountain. That's just excessive, but whatever. Go down to this storehouse. I think I hear like people in the neighborhood running around right now. Uh, Dark radiance, bone dust, bear jawses. I don't know if that's a typo or not, but. That was not quite the plan. That's more the plan. Um, uh, back from your quest already. I'm afraid we can't give you much of a parade just yet. The sky opened up like the mouth of Zeus, and those bastards. 
Rastus came down on us like a swarm of vultures, and the ground split apart like it was struck by the hammer of the gods. Metaphor, man. I saw the temple collapse with my own two eyes. No, we can't go through that door. Um, yeah, it's. I'm actually recording this on Halloween, so uh, plenty of neighborhood kids running around doing the trick or treating thing. I literally just left a bowl out on on my front porch with candy in it. It's like I just because like I've been working on stuff all evening as well, so like stuff stuff other than this. So I'm kind of like, just just let them do their thing. Um, yeah, I can definitely hear kids running around. They might be loud enough that they're actually audible. Not sure. Uh, you know what, we want to go like... Yeah, I'm not sure how we want to approach this. Because we're in the water, so those arrows aren't doing them much good. Uh, did he just vigor himself up? Don't vigor. Vigor won't save you. You need vim and vigor. I have no idea what that phrase means. That's something that seems to happen a lot, is I'm just using a phrase that doesn't... Well, it makes sense, like... You've heard it, you know, you understand what I'm on about with it, but no clue where it came from. And yeah, underwater battling is like completely silent. I don't even know if we, oh no, we do want to come up here because there's a uh, lockbox. Grab some assassin, well, we have all the assassin's arrows. We're, we're full, but we can take a hoplite do doru. Uh, well, let's switch over to these arrows. We're not we're not doing enough archery, really. Uh, especially when it's an enemy like this with no shield. So like you might as well. That so does not work. It's almost comical. I feel like this guy killed his buddy. Yeah, let's take some blast arrows. He did not kill his buddy, by the way. Oh, that guy's got blast arrows as well, it seems. Or fire arrows. Or maybe he was just burning himself. This guy's stuck, so kind of an easy, easy rap. But hey, that's what you get for being huge, you know. And, and I can sympathize to a degree. They're murdering everyone, and the ones they haven't killed, the sea is swallowed whole. Gods, where's a cask of wine when I need one? Uh, anyway, um, kind of need a repair kit. Oh, he's gonna be, like, he's gonna be our buddy, I suppose. Might as well, like, fill up our armor. Hello. We're going full phalanx on this one. That was a Roman thing, not a Greek thing, right? The whole phalanx concept. You know, it's like you, you, you have like a wall of 
of your soldiers. You know, it's like... I don't know, row like 10 wide, 10 deep, something like that. And your front group is just like... They just got big shields. Like, that's all they do is shield. Um, and then behind them are the archers that actually, you know, shoot stuff and, and whatnot. really just feels like a weapons cache. I don't feel like there's anything else in there. So, all right. Let's run on back. Reach the temple, it's like way up. So, we probably have to go like, like this. And keep going up past where we found the hunter. I've already forgotten their name. Uh, yeah, cause we can go up from here. It's a lovely co-op mode that we got going on here. I don't think he can hurt us. I'm now assuming the hunter is a guy, it probably isn't. Uh, actually, no, we got voice. I, you can tell how well I'm paying attention. You just killed the hunter. Did you just kill the hunter? That was our hunter buddy. We got a headshot on him there. Ooh, hello. So I can't figure out what the uh, what the green meter is about, but I notice it like going down. Well, especially after we took those you know, body shots. You're almost dead. Now you're dead. Now let's heal. Because we're in kind of a rough spot. Took down a lot of our armor. Only got one repair kit left. But I do believe we can craft more. Yeah. I'd say it's a good amount, honestly. Oh yeah, we can kind of climb, but there's an invisible wall, so never mind. Uh, we could have just like made the geometry impossible to climb, but eh. Right? I'm guessing this is a cyclops. That's why he's using two eyes like a taunt. Normally, it's four eyes. You know, that's. I guess that's just like. Eye taunt inflation. Like it used to be two eyes was the taunting metric, but over the years the value of eyes have gone down. You know, it's it's just the nature of economics. <clears throat> Speaking of eyes. Then straight away, cow eyed Mistress Hera with her extended palms struck the earth and spoke. Listen now to me, earth and heaven wide above, and you titan gods who dwell beneath the earth around great Tartarus, and from whom men and gods descend. You yourselves now listen to me, all of you, and grant me a child apart from Zeus, who is in no way weaker than Zeus in violence. But let him be as much superior in power as wide-seeing Zeus was over Kronos. I don't know what any of that means. Um probably means that if we knew our Homeric Odes, we probably would have seen that bit from Hera coming. Uh, maybe. I don't know. My sincerest apologies, Nicandros. Zeus has taken notice of our quest. I had to allay any suspicions of my connection to you. You are a courageous hero, to be sure, but your methods are unsubtle. Zeus, fool that he is, continues to believe in my loyalty to him. 
A necessary deception, you understand. By his command, the fury of Poseidon, Lord of the Sea, will crumble even your strongest walls to ruin. My beloved son, Ares, God of War, sends his soldiers to butcher your people. They are led by the devious Athena, whose stratagems have no mercy. Soon there will be nothing left but the boiling waters and the silence of your people. Turn your despair to vengeance, Nicandrios, for we are even closer to overthrowing that lecherous pig who sits atop the mountain. Return to Olympus. Rip the divine powers from these petty minions. Act swiftly. Your poor world may yet be spared from the wrath of the gods. Seal of the Acropolis. Bear this signet and the gates of the Olympian Acropolis will open before you. Climb the heights of the mountain. Avenge your people. Avenge your queen. Good work by the tourism board. Um, let's check the world map. Where are we? We're not really at the Olympian Gate. Uh, it's kind of... I, I'm curious, like, what level of progression we've actually obtained here. Uh, if there's anything we might be missing in our hometown, but oh well. We shall jump into the flames and carry on. Um, so by the way, Hera is definitely deceptive. Kind of a nasty trope. But I mean, this is Greek mythology that we're talking about. It's kind of a, the inventor of all the tropes. You know, it's like... It's the whole Seinfeld problem, really. You make a joke that, well, I guess the real nature of it is if you watch uh, Seinfeld now, everything in it just kind of feels like cliche and old hat because that's where it came from. Uh, not literally everything, like we had culture and society before Seinfeld, but you get the idea. I feel like there's a thing up here that we haven't explored. We've probably explored it. Plume of Harrow. That's how you get to the end game, I'm, I'm guessing. And this is how. Oh, no, not here. Up another story. So many stairs. Couldn't invent elevators. Uh, it's good to see so many guards on patrol. Makes me feel safer. Good for you. Um. <clears throat> So this is the Acropolis, where the Parthenon is. We have three new quests. Find the Trident of Poseidon, find the Crest of Ares, find the Aegis of Athena. Should maybe put our bow away. Don't really need it. Smashy, smashy. Uh, you know what we can do? A bit of exploration. Get a sense of this area. So we can definitely see, like, that was a little surprising. That's what we're going for. Okay. Sword of Midas. Carried by the Cursed King of Gold, this glittering blade turns anything it strikes into fortune. Enemies drop coins when killed. Pretty much exactly what you would expect. Um, so, uh, the guards fly now. Get a nice, uh, stabbing series in with the assassin daggers. That works. Works pretty well. Especially when you can get a rear shot on him. Look, that's an instant bystander. So that worked. Ah, oh, there's 
so many. And we still have two on our tail right now. Oh, we did not need to fix our armor, but okay. Killed a bystander, but that's what you get for being in the middle of a fight. Oh, come on. You're supposed to be dead. Oop. Something decided to go uh, awry with my computer all of a sudden. So these guys are going to be trouble. Uh, they're already kind of being trouble. Um, yeah, not sure how exactly we're going to handle this. I guess just walking away. Like he's done. Uh, we have no no shield. This could be the end. Especially if they keep summoning more enemies. Drink this. Make us stronger. Faster. Harder. I don't think it makes us harder. Um, that's a completely different drug. Hey yo. Uh, I think that's every. And okay, I finally know what that little green bar is that stamina which like duh but uh like the more you attack the more it winds down which again duh smack put out the fire And, uh, yeah, we're okay. We're totally okay. Nothing, uh, nothing amiss in our current situation. Nothing amiss whatsoever. Let's break into someone's house. Just, uh, real quick. Gather up some more supplies. Like a shield. We kind of need one. After those guards so rudely destroyed ours. Anybody home? Hmm. Bathhouse note. My dearest Cleo, the only thing that seems to soothe my anxiety lately is a refreshing soak at the bathhouse. All these troubles concerning the mortals, and now this madman on the loose, seem to wash away, at least for a little while. Come and join me later today, won't you? Here's 20% off of our Supreme Package. Um, so, okay. We got some manner of note for some purpose. Uh, heavy Greaves, Infusion of Alchristity, whatever. Olympian da Darts, not Olympian Dots. Um, decent, decent loot, decent loot. Would like to see in like inventory. Yeah, those are 
we haven't really leveled up our gear in that regard. Um, you know, we have the bathhouse note, forest stash key, symposium of sun, sun seal, guardhouse keys, scroll keepers. I imagine like when we use those items, uh, they kind of go out of our inventory. You know, they get consumed, essentially. You know, it makes lots of sense. So, uh, so that means that we haven't... All right, come on. Uh, that means we just haven't found where we're supposed to use those yet. Which makes total sense. We haven't... We haven't gone everywhere, and this is... You know, something of a Metroidvania, so... Forge of Hephaestus. We are a little bit off track right now. Hello. Um... This is some awkward, awkward fighting. Not because of the controls, just because I'm bad. Uh, Alright, you should be on fire now, so you should be all set. Stick you in the leg. And in the head. Well, that took the heat off of us. We have, yeah, we have Sword of Midas. And this is lockpick door. Fotis, or Fotis. Is up there. Yeah, some more upgrades. More goods in general. I didn't mean to wake you, dude. I just meant to stole your, steal your stuff. We have an uh, upset guard. I want to be careful because I don't want to accidentally kill Fotis. I imagine since he has a name, he has some relevance. That guy was going to trump it, so I managed to, uh, to avoid that. That's nice. Get a nice batch of uh, javelin headshots in there. Door key. An enemy of Zeus is an ally of mine. I've cached some supplies west of the market under a goat statue. I hope they help you overthrow the tyrant. All right. Uh, where's the market? Where's the goat statue? All excellent questions. Um, you know what? I think our madness will end right now. Uh, we've gotten to the next section of the game. Our, the guards aren't bothering us right now, uh, which is surprising. We're going to go uh, pay Ares a visit on the next episode. But for now, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, a like would be appreciated. Subscribe doubly so. But either way, ta-ta for now.